You know, a mite of money goes a mickle bit in this city. Think of the power of good you can do with the purse you bring. You talk a restore in London. Well, now's your chance. That there map shows who to speak to. Old friends, if you will. Give him a whiff of that sterling, and maybe you can save us all from having to leave. Shop talk. Believe Mr. Green said there was someone he wanted you to meet. Is a door nail. Of course, was wrong. Good I'm half a mind to take you home and feed you to me dogs. Them. Alec, whatever is the matter? I have been intercepting nothing but poppycock propaganda about soothing syrup and whatnot. No, I swear to high heavens, if Starrick's monopoly continues... Alec, I beg your pardon. These are friends of mine. Evie Fry and her brother, Jacob. Oh, oh um... Alexander Graham Bell. Linguist, inventor and technical expert. Alec, I have something of a favour to ask you. Can you fix this? Oh, looks like the casing is cracked. Oh, comes apart. 
I see. Could have used one of these to fit my fuses on top of Big Ben. Alec is installing a new telegraph line for our Free Press Association. To combat the static telegraph company. Now, if I can mend the fuses connecting independent lines from Big Ben, Staric will be weakened. Only we are somewhat at a handicap. And there. Yeah. Oh, I've removed the mechanism, so it may work with your bracer. I'll put it to use immediately. <laughs> Jacob, wait. Mr. Bell, allow me to help you with your fuses. Oh. You will not find me too proud to accept Miss Fry. Or oh, uh, we can use my carriage if you'd be so good as to hold the reins, though. I'll take that. Um, I, I can help you. Oh, Miss Fry, I am so glad you. Assist me. That's it. So, Mr. Bell, what inventions are you concocting? I 
710 to develop a phonetic telegraph that does not just convey dots and dashes, Miss Fry, but human voice. Phonetic telegraph? Hmm. Sounds a bit of a mouthful. You could just call it a telephone. Telephone? <laughs> How bizarre. Anyway, as I was saying earlier, the place has become entirely dependent on the Static Telegraph Company. Which is why Mr. Green has asked you to set up a free line. Yes. What is more, other small independent companies have had their lines sabotaged, and they have little means of finding any broken fuses, which are... ...to be found on top of Big Beth. Problem. I'll repair the pieces. Lovely view. Huh! <laughs> 